Welcome back, Wastelanders. Wanderer here. We've got a lot of quests to turn in today, and that is a super mutant. Hello. A super mutant tank. Wonderful. Look at Dansko taking on a mutant hound all by himself. Down. Look at dance. Okay, so anyway, we have a ton of quests to turn in. Um, one at no, several at Diamond City, I think. At least one for Mo, and I think one more as well. But I'm forgetting which one it is. And then several up at the Brotherhood uh, at the Pridwin. Have a quest in with Kells for all the stuff we did to run around finding uh, the Lost Patrol. Have a quest for Quinlan. Several actually turn in with him. Um, a couple other Radiant quests. Maybe some blood to turn in with the uh, Scrab Naraya. Just a lot of stuff to turn in. Be a bunch of experience, a bunch of caps. So I figure we'll go back and get that done. Pick up new quests and then see what we can get into. I am thinking about doing Far Harbor fairly soon. I think we are far enough along now that I could maybe head over there and do Far Harbor. That will be pretty essential to how my character reacts to certain things and how um, him and Dance do things this time around and, and how, uh, you know, I guess how this plays out the ending that I go with with this playthrough. So I want to do that sooner rather than later. I don't want to advance the main quest too much before I do that. But probably not this episode or the next episode. It's going to be, I don't know. We'll see when we get to that. Could be a bit. It's on my radar, but I mean, who knows what's going to actually get done. Also, I wanted to let you guys know that I found an amazing mod list for Fallout 3 and New Vegas. It is a Tale of Two Wastelands. Well, it one of the options is Tale of Two Wastelands. It doesn't have doesn't have to be, but um, it's pretty amazing. I guess we can talk to Mo and stuff before we go and uh, before we go and do all of, all of our daily sorting and uh, Horizon stuff here. But it's called uh, Wild Card. And there is a Tale of Two Wastelands option, which allows you to play through the entirety of Fallout 3 and then head to New Vegas as well. And it's just amazing, guys. It's just fantastic. I'm planning to do a full playthrough of Tale of Two Wastelands with that. Um, I, I've never played Fallout 3 or New Vegas and had so much fun because it feels like such a modern game with those mods installed. So keep an eye out for that. It should be a really good time. Hey, Mo. Got those baseball relics I asked for? I sure do. Got them all right here. I like your gumption. Let me take a look. Oh, this baseball. It's the real deal. You'd sign one of these and give it to the children of anyone you killed on the field. Look at that card. See those numbers on the back? Tracks the count of enemies beaten to death by the player. Check out the leather on that mitt. Ah. Really good players use them to catch bullets. True fact there. That's everything on the list. <laughs> Thank you. Far as I'm concerned, you're now a part of baseball collector history. That's that's hilarious. Yep. Okay. We did it. Um, is that all that we have here, I think? Yeah, I think it is. We gotta go talk to Preston again as well. And talk to Country Crossing. We can just travel around and do some of this stuff, I guess. Yeah, let's go to the Pridwin and turn in a bunch of quests over there. The, the, uh, the gameplay and the graphics with that mod set are just fantastic. I have made a couple of minor modifications to the, the mod list, like not in a huge way. And I'm also, I don't know, it might be a tiny bit too easy for me on the regular mode, which 
There's a regular mode and a hardcore mode, and the hardcore mode is more... It's more like a Vicious Waste or Horizon type setup than um, the base uh, base version is, but the problem is it's not as stable. And I'd rather have a stable playthrough than, you know... So, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see, we'll see. But, yeah, I, I don't know when I'll have it out. I kind of want to finish up my... Maybe not finish, but get a lot further along in my Horizon and um, my Skyrim playthrough. I have a bunch more Skyrim episodes coming out, too, if you're interested in that. So make sure you check those out. That Wildlander playthrough has been a blast so far. All right, Kells is downstairs. Let's talk to him. But, um... Captain Kells? Yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. Got a lot of new stuff planned. Report, Knight. I've completed my investigation into the missing recon team. Paladin Brandis was the only survivor. Brandis? What happened to him? He's alive and well, but he wants to be left alone. He's given up. I expected better from him. What a waste. Very well. Is there anything else? Do you want their holotapes? Thank you. I'll see that they make it to their next of kin. How will the Brotherhood remember them? They faced their mission with courage. They fought with honor against overwhelming odds. They lived and died together as brothers. That is what it means to be a member of the Brotherhood of Steel. That's all. I'll prepare a full report for the Elder. In the meantime, allow me to offer you a new suit of armor. Bear it with distinction. This was no easy mission, Knight. Well done. Now, I have a more pressing matter that requires your attention. I've received reports that supplies have been disappearing from our supply depot at the airport. I suspect this may be an inside job. Oh yeah, the uh, airport quest. Sure. Um... If so, that's a serious security risk. That's what worries me. If there is a traitor, our entire operation here could be in jeopardy. I want you to take charge of this investigation. Report to Knight Sergeant Gavel at the base. He commands our logistics division. He can familiarize you with his unit and the depot. Beyond that, you have leave to conduct your investigation as you see fit. Report your findings directly to me. Is that clear? Yes, sir. I expect results. See that I get them. Dismissed. I hate people that have to have that uh, little bit of extra, you know, I expect results. See that I get them. Like, talk down. Do you like that? I'm sure it's it's probably very common in military organizations, but it, it is annoying. All right, we got to go talk to uh, Quinlan and other people, too. It's just uh, unnecessary, I think. I don't know. Maybe disagree. Maybe you think that it is necessary and it gets results and it's uh, the best way to go about things. I don't know. Proctor. Ah, you're back. How did the scribe fare? Well... The scribe didn't make it. Give me another chance. So, the scribe was killed, which means the data was lost, which means you failed to complete. A sad loss. His memory will be upheld and honored. And the research patrols will continue. When you're ready, another scribe will be lined up for you. Still 150 caps. I can handle another patrol. Good. Meet this once found. Excuse me, Proctor Quinlan. Thanks to you, I hope to fend off the constant demands for technical data. I found some technical documents for These will prove interesting. Here are the caps that I promised. A thousand. Remember. Hell yeah. Commonwealth is an all check every building. So 40 per, that's pretty good. Or no. Uh I can't do math. It's I'm sorry, it's too it's too early for me. That I all I know is that's not right, but my brain just doesn't want to do that math problem right now, so I'm not going to. So yeah, I, I don't know what that how much it is. Whatever. Alright, so get the scribe, uh, talk to the guy down there about the food shortage, 
and report back to Scribe Halen, which, uh, eh, we got to go all the way back to the police station for that. I don't know if we'll do that or not. I don't think I can fast travel there or from there. Unless that was added recently. Do, do we actually have enough blood samples? I don't think I've gotten any so far for, uh, Naraya. Maybe they're just really rare now, or maybe they just don't exist anymore. Maybe it's, maybe it's a bug, I don't know. Okay, we're going back down. We're gonna go and, uh, do the airport quest, I guess. We can grab our scribe while we're here, too. Let me guess. Captain Kell sent you? That's right. Let's take this somewhere more private. Follow me. Where do I know We've your voice from? this section of the terminal into our primary supply depot. Everything the Brotherhood needs to operate passes through here. Supplies from the Pridwin, salvage from the field, we handle it all. <coughs> Access is strictly limited to the logistics detail, and we track every crate, every bullet, every bolt that comes through that door. I've heard his voice either from another... Which is why I don't uh, take kindly to these accusations. I know every soldier in this unit. The thought that anyone would question their loyalty makes me sick. If you've got questions, ask. Otherwise, stay out of our way. Watch your tone, Sergeant. Sir. Oh, I know. He did the really deep voice serial killer in the Fen Street Sewers. It's the same voice actor. It's just he's he's not going quite as deep on this guy. Oh my god, I never noticed that before. Okay, um... Where to start? Where should I begin my investigation? You shouldn't. This is a waste of time. I've already spoken with my men. They haven't seen anything. Tegan's scribes just fouled up the books again. If you insist on questioning someone, go bother Lucia or Clark. I can spare them. Tell me about the logistics division. I've been in charge of this unit for almost 10 years now. We're a small group. We stick together. And we keep the Brotherhood running. That's all for now, Sergeant. Take my advice. Poke around a little. Then tell the captain to let it go. It's not worth your time or mine. Hey, Clark. You're here about the thefts, right? Look, I already told Sergeant Gavel everything I know. You already spoke with Gavel? He questioned the entire unit. None of us saw anything. Look, I want to get to the bottom of this as much as anyone. What do you want to know? What's the security situation here like? We're in the middle of a hardened military base under constant guard. Nothing's getting in or out of here without us knowing about it. You really think the base is that secure? I do. And even if something did make it into the supply depot, there are knights on duty in here at all times. We'd see something. Tell me about the missing supplies. I really don't know anything. I've heard the rumors same as everyone else, but that's all. What rumors have you heard? Well, they say Raiders with stealth boys hit the terminal every night. That supplies disappear faster than we can bring them in. It's a lot of garbage. I usually work the night shift. Believe me, the only thing you risk dying of is boredom. Tell me about the logistics unit. There are what, ten of us now? Something like that. Our division reports to Proctor Teagan, up on the Pridwin. Sergeant Gavel handles day-to-day -day operations. He's run logistics for years. Other than the sergeant, there's Lucia, me, the scribes, and a few other knights who aren't fit for field duty. Lucia? I'm sorry, Knight Lucia. We were both assigned here a few weeks ago. That's all, Initiate. Sir? Hmm, works on the night shift, is trying to tell me rumors, quote-unquote, that have been going around. Which sounds like a load of BS. 
Night Lucia. Copper wire. Copper wire. Could you tell me where... Oh, I'm sorry, I don't think we've met. Night Lucia, logistics. What can I do for you, Knight? Do you have time for some questions? Oh. You must be here about the missing supplies. I'm not sure I can be of much help, but, um... What do you want to know? What's the security like around here? It's tight. At least two knights and a scribe on duty at all times. And we've got the entire base right here. We don't have much to worry about. Is there any way to get past all that security? Hmm. Well, you'd have to be in logistics. We're the only ones authorized to bring supplies in or out. Then what? Well, there's no way you'd get a full crate of supplies off base. With all the patrols, someone would notice. But why steal anything in the first place? The Brotherhood provides everything we need. No one here has any connection to the Commonwealth. I don't know. None of this makes any sense. Do you know anything about the missing supplies? Not really. I've heard it's mostly food and, um, vacuum tubes? No, sorry, they just lost those. You lost some vacuum tubes? How often are supplies lost around here? Someone had just filed them in the wrong place, apparently. Clark found them the next day. The little things do happen, but it never amounts to much. The sergeant may complain, but Proctor Teagan and his scribes are very thorough. One or two crates, maybe, but not this many. What's it like working in logistics? It's not a bad post. Sergeant Gavel is tough, but I've learned a lot from working here. I guess some people take to it and some don't. Like Clark. What about Clark? We joined the Brotherhood around the same time, about two years ago. We always seem to end up together. New recruits and all. That's all for now. Let me know if you need anything else. Now, where was I? So, dead end, but obviously something's still going on. Let's see if we can find Gavel again. Sergeant. No luck? I told you it was a waste of time. Listen, I questioned every soldier in this unit. I didn't find anything. You're not going to find anything. If you insist on going through with this, stop bothering my men and go look for some real evidence. Hell, you've got the captain's backing. You could search every damn berth on the Pridwin, and no one would raise a finger to stop you. Now, is there anything else you need from me? That's all. Hmm. Hi. Reporting for duty, sir. Oh, hey. Let's do this. Yes, sir. I'll mark the location on your map. After you, sir. Boston Mayoral Shelter. Have not gone there yet. That'll be a, a good one. It'll be fun. Haven't gone that far out to the west yet. Alright, so now we go through their footlockers, find the holotapes, incriminating them, track them, kill the feral ghouls, figure out what we do with Clark, and uh, yeah, that is this quest. Shadow them sneakily in power armor, yeah. Hmm. Probably not, but you know. Probably would not work out, IRO, I mean. Only novice, I guess I can pick it. Got it. From Lucia. Oh, that's a skill they don't teach in boot camp. Is this a holotape or just a note, I think? Have you been in my locker? Clark, what's going on? After all we've been through, I can't believe you'd do something like this. Look, this is too much, even for you. Touch my things again and I'm reporting you to the captain. She put that in... Oh, no, she put it in Clark's... I see. Ah, oh, crap. Oberlin Station. I'm busy. I'm always busy, though, to be honest. So there was Lucia's. Then we got Knight Lucia's log. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Let's see. Talking about joining the Brotherhood. 
This is getting out of hand. Clark has been late to his shifts three times this week. Each time I found him and made sure he didn't forget again, but I can't keep covering for him like this. I think Sergeant Gavel is starting to suspect something is wrong. When I got back last night, my footlocker was a mess. I think Clark has been going through my things. What's the matter with him? Why won't he talk to me? Okay, so we have some evidence there. And we have, what, a quest over here to turn into? What is this for? Where is this for? Is this technical documents? I gave all my technical documents away. Proctor Quinlan. Back already? How goes the patrol? I found some These... I don't have to. Okay, it's not actually a turn in. All right, I see. It just marks him, even though you don't have tech documents. Okay, well, uh, that doesn't fully solve things, but now we can shadow Proctor Quinn, or not Proctor Quinn, uh, initiate Clark, I think. Confront Lucia first, and then we can, I suppose, go talk to, um, well, not talk to, but Shadow Clark. Knight. Knight? You've been covering for Clark. Why? What? What are you talking about? I read your journal, Lucia. I want to know what's going on here. You what? I... <sighs> All right. Clark and I joined the Brotherhood around the same time. He's been my closest friend for years, but since the battle, I feel like I'm losing him. The battle? Battle for the airport. It was our first real combat mission. It was something to see. The Pridwin coming in under full vertebrate escort, guns blazing. We were one of the first teams to hit the ground. Dozens of ferals. We opened fire and cut them down. And hunted the ones that tried to run. It was everything I had hoped for. But Clark... He hasn't been the same since. It's like he's just given up. Since then, I've noticed him slipping off by himself. Once or twice a day. I never thought much of it, but... Do you think you could follow him? See what he's doing? His shift should be over in a few minutes. Maybe it's nothing, but I'm worried about him. War tempers the strong and breaks the weak. If that is what happened, he wouldn't be the first. It's not much of a lead, but let's see where it takes us. All right, that's it for today. Not sure if I ever have had Dance Along with me on this quest. Maybe you'll have a suggestion on what to do with him or an option to make him turn himself in. Uh-oh, he detected us. Okay, we gotta wait till we're hidden again. Can you stop detecting me, please? Really? Oh, it, it's the it's the scribe. No wonder. Yeah, I, there's no way I can make him go away. Really.
Really? Could you be a little more stealthy? Wait for it. Come on. Okay, he went in good. We fighting a bunch of barrels in here. Survey team said they had collapsed. What's he? All right. Uh, let me see. Do I have? I don't want to use plasma. I don't want to use that. Uh, this might do. Or this. What are you doing down here? I've heard nice. Of the door. This is a lot quieter. would elicit fear in most individuals. Fortunately, my training is actually weak. Target located. Hey, you. go ahead. Excuse me, Paladin Dance. Can I help? Your thoughts? I have to admit, I feel pretty damn secure when you've got my. Oh, never mind. That's, That's not uh, not a problem. I don't know, maybe you had something to comment about the dead knight over here. Guess not. Drenched with water is just going to slow us down. You want to carry me then, Dance? Not like we have much alternative. Select your targets carefully down here. These okay. automobiles tend to explode when struck by weapons fire. Wait, what was that? Exterminate them! Send them back to hell! Hold up. I think we're being stalked. out there. Those weapons cold. We may have a problem here. Not getting past me. Standing down. Oh. 
For Elder Max, send them back to hell. Kind of nice having my own little personal army here. Mission accomplished. Kill him! Huh? Over here! You may have a Over here! Target down. What was that? Over there. Out of ammo, that's fine. Red that's what that ammo is for, to be used up on ferals and other pretty easy to kill targets. Same with this stuff. This moisture is bad for my power on. Wait, what was that? We've got company. Intruder alert! Area secure. See him running in circles like that, that was pretty funny. With some advanced school tactics right there. I don't think we're No mutant alive! Long live the Brotherhood! No mercy! Company. Huh? Right here. Not getting past me. Another victory for the Brotherhood. You hear that? Found you. Cease fire. A lot of them. That's fine. More experience for me. And more loot, and they usually have caps on them, so that's nice. I think Wilson should take care of most stuff in here. Nothing that important in here is that's not lootable by him. Just checking real quick, making sure that he tags everything. Should be good. Pretty sure this is a yeah. This is a. I can't shoot through this. Give it a try. There, that's it. Not bad, is it? Easy now. Hang on. I'll get you some more. Huh? 
Who's there? Come out. You. Clark. What are you doing down here? What are you doing down here? Okay. What's going on here, Clark? Ugh. Someone was bound to catch me eventually. I can't keep this up forever. All this food? Have you been feeding these ferals? Yes. It's been working, too. What do you mean, it's been working? Why are you doing this? It's a long story. I had a friend who was a ghoul once. As human as you or me. But the Brotherhood... The Brotherhood says ghouls are abominations. They all deserve to die. Would you kill him, too? Just because of who he is? Was he a feral? What difference does it make? Weren't they all human once? I joined the Brotherhood two years ago. In all that time, I never doubted our beliefs. Never questioned them. But during the battle for the airport, the ghouls, they just kept coming. I... I killed... I don't even know how many. They started running away. But we... We kept going. I killed them. I killed them all. Kid, you did what you had to do. That's what Lucia said. But we could have stopped. We could have just driven them off. We didn't have to slaughter them. After the battle, I... I needed some time to think. I found this place. And the ghouls. What could I do? Report it, and they'd all be killed. Ignore them, and they'd attack the base. I thought, if I brought them food, maybe they'd just stay down here. There wouldn't have to be any more killing. Do you... Do you think I did the right thing? Of course not. You betrayed the Brotherhood. You put all of our lives at risk. The Brotherhood is wrong. If we just kill everything we fear, are we really any better than the ghouls? What are you going to do with them, anyway? We do what the Brotherhood expects of us. We eradicate them. No! No, I won't just stand by and let you kill them. Not again. I found this in the ruins. It's... It's Knight Ryland's holotag. He worked in the terminal with me. They killed him, didn't they? And as long as they're here... More knights are gonna die. I, I can't be responsible for that. And, and what about me? There's no way I can uh, make him turn himself in. You should turn yourself in. What? No. You know the captain. I won't even get a fair hearing. You've betrayed the Brotherhood of Steel. That's unforgivable. Then do what you have to do. Hostiles in sight! Target down. You never know what you'll find. For the Brotherhood! You guys can take care of that for me, huh? Just uh, shooting them like fish in a barrel, eh? Nice. As far as I'm concerned, it's that's about that philosophy that he had is about a, it makes about as much sense as um, wanting to protect cockroaches that infest your 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 home. They're a danger to you. They're disgusting. You know, or or rats or on any other like disease carrying um, vermin. Both of us. Oh, you're talking to the, the ghoul. I thought you were talking to me. Um, yeah, like it's... It is very extremely idealistically foolish. It's only a matter of time before I find you. Accomplished. 
Nice fusion core. Safety's off. Out of ammo, what do we use next? If I have any 45 rounds this thing, I'm gonna have to... I do, I have a bunch. Okay, well, we're gonna have to uh, reload it here, but... That's okay. Maintain your position! Your weapon's cold. And there comes a point where when something invades your living space, you have to take care of it. And when something is a danger to everything else around it, like these pharaohs are, that serve no purpose in... Like, you know, there's the food chain and everything, and there's, like, with animals, you know, you can make an argument for the um, ecosystem and stuff. You know, that's, that's all fine. I... I'm on board with that, but I, I'm i not on board with, you know, ghouls are abominations. They are quite literally are abominations made by radiation. And, um... If there's any semblance of consciousness left that was the human that they were, then by feeding them and keeping them alive, you are merely prolonging their suffering. I would want to be put out of my misery personally. I think that's the best compassion you could show them is by giving them a quick and clean death. I re and I really do feel that way IRL and I mean my character obviously would feel that way too very strongly I think. Where do you want me? I think if I just talk to him like that, he should uh, give me any dialogue things he has. I guess he doesn't have too much to say about it. All right, report our findings to Kells and be done with this. Lower level. We talk to Gavel first, I don't know. We can, I guess. Duty says. Lucia? If you need something, report to Sergeant Gavel. Hey, I just killed your buddy, though. Sergeant Gavel. You've wasted enough of my time. Guess I have to talk to the captain first. Fair enough. They need, like, a really big elevator to conserve their fuel on vertebrates for making trips up and down, you know? Just saying. That'd be a little bit more efficient. Captain. Report, Knight. Have you completed your investigation into the missing supplies? beneath the airport are filled with ghouls. Initiate Clark has been stealing rations to feed them. He was what? God, you're, you're serious. He betrayed his oath to the Brotherhood, stole our supplies, and tried to help those abominations? Where is he? What happened to him? I executed him. Here's his tag. You just killed him? He was a member of the Brotherhood, Knight. He had a right to a trial before the Elder. 
Still, after what he did, death might well have been his fate. In any event, what's done is done. It's a shame. I had high hopes for him. Very well. We'll consider this matter closed. I have some caps for your service. We have squires in need of training. They're young recruits. They need a good example to follow. Nope. I think it's time for you to pass. Nope. I don't have time for that. These squires need us. Nope. Hell no. The scribe is quiet most of the time. The kids. I swear it, they have to be bugged because they talk so much. And they repeat the same lines over and over and over again. They won't. If, if I get a mod that makes them a little bit more quiet, fine. But no, not doing it. They're too annoying. I cannot, I cannot tolerate it, dudes. I can't do it. All right. Uh, what's next? Boston Mayoral Shelter. Talk to Preston. Country Crossing. Bribe Halen. Virgil. Boston Public Library. Haven't done Boston Public Library yet. Hmm. Okay. I have two things to turn into Knight Reese and Halen. Go and do that, I suppose. I don't think I can fast travel there. It is getting to be late at, well, in the evening, so I'll um I'll go back in here actually and fast travel back to the castle and uh, take care of Horizon stuff. But I think we'll call it here for this episode, and uh, I'll think about what I want to do in the next one while I'm doing my daily, you know, daily horizon grind going through my stuff and all that good stuff. So anyway, thanks for watching everyone and I'll see you next time.